morning guys welcome or welcome back to my channel i feel like i always start my videos on this couch it's like really comfy the lighting is good and it's also where i just like sit and journal and kind of like plan my videos so it kind of makes sense because i get excited and i want to like get into it but anyways today i am back in miami if you cannot tell by the background i figured i would film the ultimate get my life together get my shit together type of video because i have been out of the country for literally a whole month and then my boyfriend went on a work trip and then he came and visited me in canada for a little bit so we just flew back into miami last night so naturally there's a lot to do in order to get back into the regular schmegular routine first and foremost we have to deep clean this whole place there hasn't been anyone here to take care of it so the place is kind of a mess so today we're gonna be cleaning everything up, getting everything organized. We have a lot of laundry that we need to do. There's food in the fridge that has gone bad that I need to throw out. We also need to do a grocery run and kind of like figure out what meals are gonna be meal prepping for the time that I'm here. And then of course, I have to transition back to my day-to-day -day routine of like working out, getting stuff done, being productive, etc., etc. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. I have a whole list of things here that I need to do today and I'm hoping to kind of get them done quick because I hate stagnant like in between energy like like coming back from a trip and everything feels out of place and you're not in a routine like i personally thrive on routine and my daily rituals and everything like that so we're gonna be doing all of this stuff today so that tomorrow everything is back to normal we got in really late last night and we already washed the bedding because the kitties had been sleeping on it and it was full of cat hair so we already did that and then i woke up a couple hours ago and just like slowly ease into the day i ordered myself coffee and breakfast because obviously we don't have anything in the fridge that i can eat that has not gone bad all the time on little brunch i was also listening to my favorite podcast which just like got me in the best like headspace and i'm just like so inspired i'm super excited to have like a really good productive day today get shit together, get everything back in order, etc, etc. So let's get started. First load of laundry i have at least two more to do and there's some laundry on here that was already in the dryer that needs to be put away so i'm gonna do all of that later in the meantime i really want to tidy up the apartment specifically i ran the little electric roomba like the little vacuum last night and i picked up a lot of the stuff but i kind of want to go in with a little room around all the corners and under the furniture where the roomba cannot reach because there's just like random dust and cat hair and stuff everywhere and i just really want to clean that up so really need to do a general like tidying up of putting things away because there's just like a lot of random things that are misplaced from when we came home really late last night and we just like dropped everything off basically by the door we haven't unpacked we haven't done anything and also from last minute packing you know when you're packing in a rush like you kind of leave things kind of messy so i want to put all those things away so let's do that out later today so it's really gonna help kind of like keep it at the back of my mind that i still need to work out but also it's like workout set type of material so it's like still comfortable but i don't know it just like keeps me motivated that this is the time that i'm supposed to be productive whereas like if i just like lounge around my pajamas all day it's so easy to just like not really know when i'm supposed to be working when i'm supposed to be productive and when i'm supposed to just be relaxing so this really great tip i do this every time i'm feeling like unmotivated to do things that i know i'm supposed to be doing i just like change the outfit into something that kind of like matches the vibe so let's continue on these are from gymshark and then this i found at a thrift store it is from adidas so let's go this is what the workstation is looking like right now honestly kind of messy i have to like figure out where this is gonna go throw out the empty packaging this is like snacks that i brought on the plane my airpods are just like casually chilling there should probably find their case and charge them and i just want to like wipe everything down and get everything nice and organized here the 
the first load of laundry is almost done and there's still two more that I need to do so I'm just gonna like separate the colors and the whites and get started on that so my boyfriend never checked his pockets so I want to make sure that there's like no airpods or anything like that just chilling and the pockets always gonna empty this if you don't want your house to catch on fire I think that the kitties think that we're about to leave again because every time the suitcases come out they always know and they start roaming nearby and <laughs> look at them they're just chilling I feel so bad I'm just unpacking we're not going anywhere. <laughs> I feel like that's the worst part with like traveling when you have pets. It's like you cannot explain to them that you're coming back or like how long you're gonna be gone or that they're gonna be taken care of. Like there's always gonna be somebody that comes to like feed them and play with them and hang out with them and take care of them and stuff like that. But I don't know, I feel so bad. I feel like every time I leave that they think I'm abandoning them. And I'm like, no, I would never leave you behind. What do you mean? Right now we're gonna do what I like to call the cat mom duties. This is like stuff that you do to take care of the cats and some of it you do every single day of course. But it also includes like other stuff that you don't necessarily do every day that you do every week or every other week. So for example, I really need to change the filter in their water fountain. This isn't something you do every day but every like two to three weeks you're supposed to change it and it has not been changed since we both been gone. So we're gonna do that right now. Also, don't mind the noise in the back. I have washer and dryer going at the same time, but time to fix this mirror. I was really worried that the cats were gonna like randomly get the zoomies and like freaking run into it and break it and like get hurt. So when we were gone, I opened up to like its full opening kind of like length here. Cause I was just like really scared. But now that we're back, I'm gonna push it back a bit just because like it looks kind of weird from this side. It's like blocking half the hallway. So let's do that. So you brought home these big ass plants. So I guess now we're gonna be plant parents and have to figure out how to take care of them. We have to dust them off because they're in the workshops. So tons of freaking dust. Yeah, but they're so pretty. So clean them. I'll get a little bit more potting soil to store too this week. Yes. They will be thriving. What are they? Um, this is a fig, I believe. Uh huh. Yeah, the big one is, it's a fiddle leaf fig. Okay. And this one <laughs> Kalia looks terrified. is a plant. Okay. <laughs> and there's a down. 
I don't know what this one is, man. I gotta be a hundred with you. It's so pretty. I, don't I cannot. Act like I, know. I can't wait to freaking get this all pretty and alive looking. <laughs> the random little final thing, okay. Anyways, this is what the place looks like right now. It's so cute, it's so peaceful. I absolutely adore the lines here from the sun. It's just like so fun. The place is coming together. It feels very cozy. I was sitting here editing, so don't mind this mess. This is where I was just working. I'm waiting for my video to finalize updating and then I will be posting that probably tomorrow. Look at this pretty girl, hi, hi. So you have more laundry going. This is like the third load that we've done today But we're also about to go grocery shopping. Like I said, the fridge is literally empty And then a couple things that have literally gone bad that I need to throw out. We don't have anything So I'm gonna make a list of all the things that we want to get and yeah, this is the fit check We're gonna do a little grocery run soon <laughs> What's that? The grocery store runs a jelly <laughs> Just came back from not one but two grocery stores and we ended up getting so much stuff so let's put all that away <laughs> Expecting everything. This is what we got from the grocery store. Lots of fruit and veggies and salad stuff. We got, excuse me, we got some eggs. <laughs> we got pasta, we got some potatoes, two types of beef. We got some extra stuff like peanut butter that we needed. We got some maple syrup, got some yogurt, we got some bread, all kinds of stuff. Some meat and some cheese for girl dinners. And everything like that. Diva is inspecting everything. We also got two of these Coca-Cola Zero Packs. Overall, very successful grocery store trip. We needed to restock on a lot of this stuff, so it's gonna be really great to have all these options for things to eat throughout the week and to snack on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 